Now, in this uh, review for test on December 4th, we have the second problem like this. Here, you have to do three transformations. If you see carefully this one, this is a reflection with respect to y-axis and then reflection with respect to x-axis and then rotation 90 degrees. Actually, though these three are in this order, but the last one we have to do first and then this middle one second and the first one last. So, actually if you observe the given coordinates, P, 3, 5, Q, 9, 5, R, 7, 7. And if you first do a rotation 90 degrees, and what are the coordinate rules for rotation 90 degrees? You have to first flip them. See, P single prime, 3, 5 becomes 5, 3. And for 90 degrees, you have to put negative sign for X coordinate. In the similar way, Q prime is, this 9, 5 becomes 5, 9, and put negative sign for the X coordinate. Let us see, R single prime. 7, 7, if you interchange, you will again get 7, 7, and put negative sign for X coordinate. In this way, you get the coordinates for uh, when you do rotation. Next, we have to reflect along X axis. So, for reflection along X axis, what you have to do, you have to keep X coordinate as it is. What is X coordinate here? Negative 5. Keep as it is. I am not changing. Only Y coordinate you have to change the sign. It is 3. For that you have to attach a negative sign. See, one more time. You observe for Q prime, Q double prime, I'm sorry. This is P double prime. So, Q prime, single prime, it is negative 5. You keep that negative 5 as it is. Whereas for 9, you make it as negative 9. In the same way, R double prime. If you see this, negative 7, 7. So, keep negative 7 as it is. And for positive 7, it becomes again negative 7. You are changing the only y coordinate for this reflection with respect to x axis. And again, if you see this one after reflection along x axis, then we have to do reflection along y axis. So, for that, you have to do like this P triple prime. You keep y coordinate as it is. Negative 3, keep negative 3 as it is. Only make change in the x coordinate. Negative 5 becomes positive 5. In the similar way, Q triple prime. Here it is negative 5, negative 9. Keep negative 9 as it is. And only make change in the positive, I mean, the x coordinate as positive 5. And see, finally, R triple prime. It is negative 7 for y coordinate, don't change. You write as it is y coordinate because this is with respect to y axis. Whereas x coordinate becomes negative 7 becomes positive 7. So in this way, you have to write the coordinates. But in this problem, he is insisting to draw all the four graphs. For everything, you have to graph. See, here also graph and state the coordinates. We have already stated the coordinates. In the similar way, we have to draw the graphs. 3, 5, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Here is P. And you get Q, 9, 5. 1, 2, 3, 6, 9, and 5. This is Q. And then 7, 7. 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. This is R. If you use ruler and join, you get triangle PQR's graph. In the similar way, this graph, P single prime, this Q single prime, R single prime. So negative 5 and positive 3. Here is P single prime. I can use red color this time. And then Q, negative 5 and 9. 
four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Here it comes up as Q single prime and then negative seven and positive seven. Four, five, six, seven. Here is R single prime. Join them using ruler. You can get the triangle P single prime, Q single prime, R single prime. Like this the triangle. And then if you see this P double prime, negative five, negative three. So I'm using this pen, negative five, negative three. It comes up here, and then negative five, negative nine, negative four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, negative nine. This is Q double prime, and this is P double prime, and then R negative six, negative seven, again negative seven. If you go down into three, four, five, six, seven, this is negative seven. So you can write R double prime. Join them, you will get the required triangle in this way. So join them using ruler or freehand like this. Next, finally, we have P triple prime as five, negative three, one, two, three, four, five, negative three means I have to go down this is P triple prime and then Q 5 negative 9 1 2 3 4 5 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 negative 9 that means down here is the point that is Q triple prime and then finally 7 negative 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and then negative 7 negative 1 negative 2 negative 3 4, 5, 6, 7, negative 7 comes here. That is R triple prime. Again, you join, then you get the required triangle. So, in this way, the originally PQR translated to this position by doing this rotation of 90 degrees, and then from here, we are getting this by reflecting along x axis, and again from here to here, it is going by reflection along the y-axis. In this way, we do this uh, transformations, composition of the transformations all at one place. So this is how you have to write the coordinates as well as uh, draw the graphs. Thank you.